my name is Satya. Hope you guys are all doing well. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I achieve this makeup look. So this is the makeup I used all the products under 300 rupees. So this is the first time I'm creating this kind of a makeup look using only uh, under 300. So I really like the way it turned out, and every product is really nice. And I was amazed of using all those products. So if you wanna see how I achieve these products, and if you wanna see how I, uh, what are the products I used in this video, please continue watching. And if you're new to my channel, please take a moment to subscribe and click the bell icon whenever I post a video you will be notified before that I have given all the names links everything in the description box so please check that out and I'm gonna put the screen over here uh, I mean uh, display the name of the product and the price so that you will not be confused so even I am not confused about the products so without wasting any more time we'll get started Okay guys, I'm gonna start with the moisturizer. For that we have the Pond Super Light Gel Oil Free Moisturizer. So this is what it looks like. So I'm gonna uh, mention the price and the name in the screen. So this is a very uh, jelly kind of a moisturizer which really absorbs into the skin and leaves that really non-sticky uh, face. This is the best moisturizer under 300 rupees. I really like this moisturizer. So next we'll be moving on to the primer. For that I have this one. This is the Inside Cosmetics Primer. Primer. This is called 3 in 1 Primes, Protects and Moisturizes Long Lasting which is oil free. So this is a silicone based primer which gives a really good matte uh, finish. So I am gonna take a piece of amount and I am gonna apply all over my face. So as you can see it is a, a mattifying primer. So this feels very nice guys. I don't feel the, I don't see that kind of a stickiness. It uh, feels that very, it gives a really good mattifying effect to my face. So next we will be moving on to the foundation. For that I have this one. This is the Maybelline Fit Me uh, Matte Plus uh, Portless Foundation. So this is in a tube form. So this is a shade 330 toffee. So I feel this is one of the best foundation under 300. So this is the smaller version of the Fit Me foundation. Uh, foundation in a tube form so this would be a nice uh, foundation for traveling and all because of the size you can just keep it in your purse so I'm gonna dot all over my face and then I'm gonna blend it with my beauty blender so I'm really happy that I could find my shade in this uh, foundation so as you can see guys it gives such a pretty good coverage and uh, one of the amazing foundation for oily skin girls so if you are a college girl this would be a nice foundation as you can see it gives a really good mattifying effect and it feels very lightweight I really like this foundation guys as a first layer as you can see uh, more majorly my scars have been covered with this foundation next we'll be moving on to the concealer for that I have this new concealer this is the miss Claire full coverage uh, concealer so I have bought two shades of uh, for my skin tone one is a shade called 10 and one more is the shade called 14 so I'll be using these two uh, concealer to go, uh, cover my dark circles so this comes in a jar form uh, which looks like this so I'll be using a flat brush to apply this so first I'm gonna use a shade uh, 10 on my under eyes around my mouth I'll be using the shade 14 which is a little bit darker in shade so which is a very creamy formula I thought it would be a very thick to, uh, so this is very uh, creamy so again I'm gonna blend it with my beauty blender so the concealer is pretty good I really like the coverage of the concealer and the blendability was very nice uh, the shade 14 is really nice for my spot correcting as you can see I could apply this on my spots and it blended very nicely and the coverage is also pretty nice so I'm gonna set this concealer with the uh, translucent powder so for that I'll be using the Swiss uh, beauty prime set uh, mattifying uh, loose powder so this comes in this kind of a jar formula I'm gonna take it in a beauty blender so I'm really liking as a first impression so this feels like uh, sugar translucent powder so the uh, for the consistency the powderiness of the uh, this loose powder is like a sh sugar translucent powder so this would be a nice tube for that so next to set my interface I have this one this is the color essence compact powder so this is what the outer packaging looks like so the original packaging comes in this kind of a uh, form so when you open you get a plastic cover to cover the uh, powder and this is what the shade looks like I feel this would be a lighter shade for me so anyway just will apply and then we'll see the, I feel this would be a nice shade for me because uh, the translucent powder and this powder will mix together and gives a really good uh, match for my skin tone so till now I don't see any kind of problem while doing my makeup I feel a uh, very nice and the products went very nicely on my face and gives a really good matte finish to my face so at this point I'm gonna set my face for that I have the in color cosmetics a uh, master 
Fix Wear Boosting uh, Setting Spray. So this is what the original packaging looks like. Ooh, it just went like a water spray. So at this point I'm gonna complete my eye makeup and then we'll be finishing our face makeup. So first I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows. For that I have this one. This is the Miss Claire Waterproof Eyebrow Pencil. I really like this pencil guys. Uh, since I bought I have been using this and uh, it gives a really good uh, bushy eyebrows. I really like this one. So this product comes with this kind of a brush which really helps to uh, spread the product. So this one it's very handy which comes with a cap. So as you can see the pigmentation of eyebrow pencil is really really great and gives a really bold, big bold eyebrows. So I'm gonna just brush the product with the uh, brush which comes with the other end. So this feels very handy so you no need to search for the spoolie. So next we'll be moving on to the eye makeup. For today's video I'll be using this one. This is the Wet n Wild Color Icon uh, Quad Eyeshadow Palette. So this is a one, one color theme uh, uh, eyeshadow palette. So we, you get more than uh, 8 to 9 eyeshadow uh, quads so that you can uh, uh, buy just uh, one uh, one particular color which you want for that particular occasion so i'm gonna use this uh, shade uh, i really like this uh, purple pinky and all so i'm gonna use this today so i'm gonna start with this uh, dark plum kind of a shade oh as you can see the pigment is really really nice as you can see the pigment and the blendability and the uh, color tracing is really good so within a budget and, uh, and only for $2.99 you get an amazing eyeshadow palette. So next I'm gonna take this uh, light. So this could be a light purple kind of shade which I'm going to use it as a transition color and blend it uh, the previous uh, crease shade. So with the help of previous brush I'm going to intensify the plum shade. So next I'm gonna take this uh, purpley pink kind of a shade as my uh, shimmer shade. So to intensify this uh, shade I'm gonna use a setting spray uh, to wet my brush. Ooh, as you can see, uh, once after uh, wetting the brush, it gives that really good uh, pigmentation. So, uh, fallout wise, uh, the matte shade doesn't give any kind of fallout. Uh, the shimmer shade has a little bit of fallout that to very minimal. So, I can use it a brush to dust it off. So, I'm gonna take this uh, white uh, shade uh, which I'm going to apply this on my inner corners. So as uh, center of my eyelid means this portion. Now I'm gonna take that plum uh, shade which I used uh, as a crease so to uh, blend the edges of the shimmery shade. So next for the kajal I'll be using the Rimmel Soft Coal Kajal Eyeliner Pencil. So I really like the Rimmel uh, Coal Pencil so in my last uh, uh, Rimmel video I tried another coal pencil which is also very affordable. I really like that one also. So under 300 this would be a nice cold pencil guys as you can see the pigment is really nice. So next I am going to take that uh, plum shade which I am going to apply uh, to smoke out the lower lash line. So next for my liner I am going to use my old favorite which I was using in my college days. This was the uh, one of the uh, affordable and I was using uh, non-stop. So this is the LIT in blackout liner which is a really really amazing uh, liner. So I forgot uh, about this really. So I still remember uh, in my college days I used to struggle to align uh, my uh, wing. Uh, today I am very happy that I could uh, easily uh, create a wing liner. So next for the mascara I have the uh, Miss Clear Waterproof Mascara. So this is what it looks like and I really like this uh, mascara since I bought. So I have been using since I bought this uh, mascara. I really like the way it applies on my lashes. So it really separates the hairs and gives a really good uh, lengthening uh, effect. It doesn't give volume but it gives a really uh, good um, effect on my uh, lashes. 
So eye makeup is done. I really like the way it turned out. So everything went very nicely. So next I'm gonna complete my rest of my face. So I'm gonna use a contour and blush with this palette. So this is the LA Colors uh, 3D Blush uh, Contour uh, Palette. So in this uh, you get a contour highlight and a blush. So I thought this would be a nice option to include in this video guys. So this is the price that would be $5.95 but uh, currently uh, they have a, a lot of discounts running. So this I bought it uh, under 300 rupees. So this would be a nice option. So you don't need to search for a contour and a blush. You get both the things in one palette. So I'm gonna just apply on my cheekbones to be just bronze up my face. Ooh, as you can see the pigment is really nice. I'm gonna apply on my forehead just to create that bronzing effect. So as you can see this side of my face looks really good shadow effect. I really like that. So next for the blush I'm gonna take this shade. A nice pigmented shade and this will this would be a nice shade for my skin tone so if you are my skin tone this palette is really a good affordable palette must try palette guys so next we'll be moving on to the highlighter for that i have this one this is the swiss beauty blusher and highlighter so this is what the outer packaging and this is what the uh, original packaging looks like i really like this uh, this reminds me the uh, um, makeup revolution reloaded highlighter pigmentation wise is also really nice i have taken very small amount it doesn't give any kind of chunkiness it gives a really subtle uh, glow so guys as you can see the highlight is really beaming uh, i really like the way it turned out so it doesn't give any chunky kind of ness and uh, applies very nicely so i really like this highlight guys uh, this would be a nice uh, a highlighter for beginners so under a 300 this is really nice guys as you can see it's just beaming on my face so for the lipstick i have this one this is the iba moisture rich uh, lipstick uh, this is the shade called uh, caramel uh, creme so this is something i'm trying for the first time this is what the uh, outer packaging looks like and this is what the original packaging of the lipstick looks like so i have bought the shade a uh, very light a uh, nudie kind of shade so that i can match it for any outfit and any eye makeup smells really nice pigmentation wise also very nice so i feel really like this lipstick shade guys uh, what you feel let me know in the comments so as you can see it's a very rich uh, creamy kind of a texture i really like the texture and it doesn't uh, feel um, very uh, chappy like that so it has uh, applied very nicely on my lips and it gives a really good um, moisturizing effect uh, till now i don't see any kind of problem so it's really nice uh, lipstick uh, i have chosen a nice lipstick i feel so i'm gonna set my hairs and i'll be back to show you the final result so guys this is the final makeup look guys hope you like this video if you like it give it a thumbs up comment below what was your opinion and if you want to see uh, this kind of a video like uh, products under 300 products under 400 500 600 so i would like to do this kind of a videos guys so please let me know in the comments and do follow me on my instagram to see a lot of different looks and uh, to chat with me and draw uh, what are the products i used in this video i'll be giving the name and the link in the description box so you can check that out so before leaving please take a moment to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next video guys thank you so much for watching bye